one of those that shocked the dog. And they told me, they said, uh, your dog Petey, because for one, I got him some pet smart food there, and it's just made him pet dumb. Um, when I sleep, he's up, and when I'm up, he's sleeping. And it doesn't make any sense. So he kept running away, and I'd be asleep. So finally, they told me to get a dog collar that shock him. So I do that. And when I shock him, it was raining, and it killed him. And they said, he'll stop running, but I didn't know it'd be forever. I mean, I just wanted to return it, and I was hoping someone would come out there and help me bury Petey. Okay, um, shocking collars, you have to read on there that you adjust them according to the dog. Well, um, he, weighed, he weighed 10 pounds. He weighed 10 pounds, and they told me to crank that sucker up, so I did. I'm, um, I'm, I think nobody probably would have told you to crank it up on a 10 pound dog. They did. Because it's supposed to be according to their size. Like, if you read on there, like, we, you know, we wouldn't have said crank it up on a 10 pound dog. Well, I was talking to Tina, and Tina's the one told me to do that. Um, I'm Tina, and I know that I didn't tell you to crank it up on a 10 pound dog. Uh, it was Tina. No, I know. I'm telling you right now that I know I didn't. Oh, wait a minute. It might have been Sarah then. It was either you or Sarah. It wasn't me. Well, I heard. Sarah works in the salon. So. Well, it was one of y'all. I. No. I was getting them clean to whoever I talked to about it, so it was one of y'all. And I don't know if you have me on speakerphone or what, but I heard some people giggling, and it's not funny. I heard Sarah giggling. Sarah's in the salon working on a dog. Nobody's giggling. I'm highly upset. Will you guys at least return my collar? No, we will not return your collar. Will you help bury Petey? <laughs> no. <laughs> Alright, Bartle. A prank. No, it's not, ma'am. But I'll Bartle do. <laughs> Bart will do to you, ma'am. <laughs> See, dude, I had that chip.